Hello YouTube, here's me, Stevie P. I have a question for you. If you go for a job, you want to get hired, you need to earn a living, do you dress up? I'm not saying, you know, evening gown or tuxedo, but do you dress up, show up presentable? I'm just curious, because in the 40 or so resumes I have been handed in the last couple of months, one person has dressed up. Sadly, that one person was someone I cannot hire, but one person has appeared to make any sort of an effort. Now, I'm just wondering if maybe where I am, there's just too much money flowing around and everyone's too rich. Uh, or if people are just not taught the skills of... Maybe the people don't have a job because they don't know how to get a job. I'm horrified. I always dressed up. I would wear a suit for every job interview. Every job interview, I wore a suit. You know what? You know how many jobs I was not hired for? One. You know which one that was? McDonald's. I applied at McDonald's four times. I had this industrial resume, and they would not hire me. It was very frustrating because I wanted to do a McDonald's manager training program because I wanted a franchise. I wanted a McDonald's. But I wanted to I wanted to know how the business ran. And I don't know if it was just the hiring guy didn't like me or what the deal was. It was always the same McDonald's too, so I guess I it was the one that was near where I lived. Four times never hired me. It's the only job that I had been ever been turned down for. I've always chose the job I want to do, but I've always done whatever I needed to to make sure that the person I was asking for said job um, would would want me to work for them. I work hard. I show up. I'm respectable. I'm respectful, and I'll do what I need to do to get the job done. But I am just absolutely horrified. As a business guy, if you want to work for me, I want you, I want you to appear to want to actually work for me. I want to know why you want to work for me. I want to know... I, I realize people need a job. But when I ask you why you want to work for me, for my store, uh... uh uh, is not an answer. It really, it, it isn't. And if if I get one more person coming in in windbreaker and shorts, or or a wife beater vest, or smelling like weed, like really, hey man, um, I need a job. Can I work here? I just drove here stoned. Guess what, guy? I probably don't want you. Just, just thinking about it, you know. It's. I'm a delivery company. Do not come and apply for a delivery job if you don't have a license. Really? I, I, I don't. My best people coming in to see me right now are like 15, 16, and 17. I have a 13-year-old boy who I inherited. Um, 13. I'm like, ah, oh, why do I? He was a sign waver, a banner shaker. I don't really do the banner shaking thing. I thought, ah, oh, it's probably a waste of money. You know, we're paying two of these people five days a week. Seems like a lot of money for, for nothing. I never bought food because I saw a banner. Someone said, hey, come and eat at my place. I've never thought, hey. That's where I want to eat now. Never. The only time I have looked at those is when it's uh, bikini car washes. And uh, not that I would ever go to a bikini car wash to get my car washed because there's girls in bikinis. Because to tell you the truth, it's a little creepy now.
because they're like high school girls, right? Trying to raise money for something. I just go pay my four dollars in the coin watch. It creeps me out a little bit. I'm like, when I was four, when I, when I was like twenty though, that was that was awesome. It was great. Yeah, that is the only time I've ever paid attention to a sign waiver. That's it. So. But I, I, I got this kid, and uh, he is one of the best little workers ever. So it opened my mind to the idea that maybe young people are, are really good. I, I've, in the past, I've liked older people because uh, they have bills, and they show up for work and stuff. But right now, I'm just, I cannot find decent employees, and it's killing me. And the people I'm getting make me want to punch myself in the face. You get that resume, and it's like, really, really. If you can't take the time to get dressed, if you if you can't take the time to shave, maybe put on matching socks or wear your shorts the right way out or something. If you cannot t take the time to do that, you're probably not going to get hired. I'm just saying. Do you guys have any hiring horror stories? I would like to hear your hiring horror stories. People who have come into your place looking for work or people, maybe even employees, who just don't get it. I would love to hear the story. Um, video responses below. And uh, you guys rock. Thanks for watching. I just wanted to vent and get your uh, get your input on this. Really, have you ever have you ever gone and got a job just in like your scruffy clothes or anything like that? I'm just curious.